You know, also breaking from overnight, a tragic scene in oh, North Houston. A teenager and a child dead in a matter of minutes. This is truly sad. This happened after police say a group of children were playing with a gun. ABC 13's Charlie Entity joining us now live with all the details. Good morning to you, Charlie. Good morning. Yeah, the details, uh, what we know so far from investigators, incredibly tough to hear. And so we know that the child who was accidentally shot did end up passing away there at the scene of this shooting. And as for the teenager who ended up, or who we've learned, ended up shooting himself, that person was still alive by the time first responders got to the scene, but then uh, was rushed to the hospital and sadly also later died. And so let's take a look at some video from the scene captured overnight by our ABC. 13 cameras. You can see a large crowd of people. We've learned several of those people are family members of the kids who were involved in this. We know a group of children between the ages of 10 and 17 years old were gathered there at the complex. It sounds like they're all family members. Right now, HPD investigators say it appears the gun was brought by the 17 year old who was likely showing it off. Well, another juvenile in that group was handling that gun when it accidentally fired, striking the child who was killed. Investigators say the 17 year old grabbed that weapon and then ran to a wooded area near that apartment complex. Family members were trying to talk to him because they say he was just incredibly upset over what happened. Officials say that teen fired a few more shots. One of them did hit the apartment complex, but nobody was hurt, thankfully, and that's when the teen shot himself. And obviously, still so many unanswered questions this morning uh, in the investigation, including important details about the gun. As far as the weapon, we're not sure if the weapon was inside of the home or if this individual was carrying that weapon himself. So um, again, we're conducting an investigation on that portion. And this morning, HPD is reminding all gun owners to properly store and lock up their weapons to prevent the weapons from getting into the hands of children. Charlie at City, ABC 13 Eyewitness News. Charlie, thank you.